We have breaking news, a major development in St. Louis County government. News 4 has learned that County Executive Steve Stanger is resigning. Let's get to Lauren in the newsroom right now. Lauren. Guys, that's right, and the resignation is being confirmed by Stanger's attorney, Scott Rosenblum, who texted me just a few moments ago saying that the county executive is planning on resigning today. We do know that Stanger has been indicted on federal charges, three counts, in fact, of mail fraud, stemming, according to the indictment, from 2014 to 2018. It says here that various individuals and Stanger scheme to defraud and deprive the citizens of St. Louis County of their right to honest and faithful services. Now, as a lot of you know, there has been a lot of action and intense scrutiny around some of Stanger's uh, contracts, especially when it comes to his campaign donations. There's been some allegations that he did in fact um, give some contracts or give some favorable treatment to people who ended up getting contracts in the county. So that's been a very key part of what's been a long federal investigation looking into those contracts. We know a couple months ago the uh, county was served with a subpoena excuse me one second, <laughs> the county was served with a subpoena when it came to these contracts. The county uh, was asked to hand over documents, uh, information, basically correspondence from the county executive to uh, the federal investigators to kind of look into whether or not Steve Stanger gave any favorable treatment to these contractors. Now we know that the county executive has been indicted on three counts of mail fraud. Looks like I'm going to have the, um, <laughs> thank you very much. So I've got here with me the indictment, just kind of reading through it a little bit, um, taking a look a little bit more. The indictment alleges that Stanger, in exchange for campaign donations and several fundraising events, took official action to ensure that John Rollo and his company, Cardinal Insurance, obtained insurance contracts through St. Louis County during 2015 and 2016. Now, the indictment alleges that Stanger took official action to ensure that John Rollo and his company, Cardinal Creative Consulting, obtained a 2016 consulting contract through the St. Louis County Port Authority. This is information I'm reading through right now from a press release from the U.S. Attorney's Office. Again, they are confirming that County Executive Steve Stanger has been indicted on three counts of mail fraud. Those charges do carry a pretty significant sentence, up to 20 years in prison if he's convicted on each of those counts. Um, we are hearing that the U.S. Attorney's Office is going to have a press conference later today about 1 o'clock. Of course, you can count on News 4 to bring you all of the latest developments on this story. We're going to have more information on KMOV.com, our news app, and throughout the day here on our broadcast. Guys. All right, Lauren Trigger uh, reporting live in our newsroom, and of course, uh, she'll continue that coverage and uh, probably have more details at noon. But Steve Stanger, the county executive, is going to be resigning, facing indictments at the federal level. Not good. No. Not good. Big story, and you'll yeah. hear a lot more about it as we break it here on News mm -hmm. 4 for you.